Hey everyone, uh, in this video tutorial, just I'm going to uh, teach you how to design uh, image component. Just uh, I have an example of the image component. Like uh, just I want to take it uh, author name like a Jacob. Mm, mm, that is the author name Jacob, and the bio is also Jacob. And choose image file. Just I want to teach about this one. Okay, so choose file name. So just I want to pick it here and here we have to uh, pick this one. So uh, save changes like that. So uh, images will be also saved in, in your uh, uh, server project. So here we have a Jacob and just when we click to edit button, your image will be rendered. So uh, how to uh, design uh, that component that is the choose file in a blazer. Before going to much more detail, uh, just I want to tell about uh, my membership program. Uh, that membership program is only 800 rupees for the Indian users and $1. fifteen for the other users. In this membership, I will provide you .NET Core video tutorials, complete video tutorials and also project based video tutorials. So uh, here uh, I will give you two projects um, in a .NET Core. The same price, I mean to say that uh, only one time you can pay 800 rupees or $1.15 and you get video tutorials on these technologies based or uh, you can say it's a project based video tutorials. I will give you complete source code and uh, complete video tutorials like SQL Server video tutorials and React Paces video tutorials, Dapper, Rast API, Angular, Entity Framework Core. MS test unit, uh, .NET Blazor, unit test, HTML, jQuery, CSS, and many more technologies actually include. So only pay 800 rupees or $1.15 for the other country users. You will get video tutorials on these technologies. That is the uh, one-time fees, you can say. Okay. So if you want to join this membership, please fill this form. And after fill this form, get a membership okay if you want to join this membership and you want to get unlimited uh, courses list uh, video tutorials and a complete video tutorials that is beginning to advanced video tutorial on dotnet core uh, blazor WebAssembly, and uh, angular react javascript jquery and uh, many more technologies included in only just 800 rupees or you can say that dollar 15 if you want to join this membership, just fill this form and this form uh, link will be available in video description box. So just check the video description box and uh, join the membership. So just fill this form, your name, your email ID, your contact number and transaction reference ID or order ID or PayPal ID. If you uh, are belong to uh, India, just pay 800 rupees on this QR code and if you belong to other country like uh, out, outside of India, you can say. So just uh, pay by the PayPal. And here is my PayPal ID that is narinkumar8500 at gmail.com and just pay $1.15. Okay. So link is check now in description box. Thank you very much. Assembly. So uh, here we have a razor component. Here we have a choose image file where we have a input file and that accept jpg.zipac.png file when we click to on uh, change button so when we uh, to click to choose file then uh, that event is triggered like select image so here we have a select image you can see so here we have a input file change event arguments e by using the input file change event args you just get multiple files there we have a multiple files and here we have a list of files. So just I want to get a one image file, one by one. So new byte, just get the bytes uh, array. So here we have a byte array. Uh, just convert the image file dot size. And after that image file, just uh, read uh, as a stream. So open read stream dot read async uh, that array. And after that, you just convert that byte array uh, in the string format that is the base 64 string so convert dot base 64 string okay uh, and also 
it's a child component in a web assembly so uh, here we have a parameter that is event callback that render or you can say that that send a string uh, url to the parent component by using this event callback string send image url so send image url dot invoke async base 64 string so here we go for a, a base 64 string or you can say that image url now after that um, here we have anything uh, image is there like image url is there from the parent component in the edit uh, scenario so that image will be displayed and after send the base 64 image that image url uh, will be null and state has been changed okay now uh, your image will be displayed if you select or you can choose the file from this one so that is the uh, uh, component to use in a blazer